Here in St. Pete, you can enjoy a glass of wine, a cup of coffee, and a good book at Book and Bottle. Yeah, the one-stop shop opened doors early for us this morning, and Jabari Thomas narrates the goodness of this St. Pete spot. What's up, man? Yeah, what's happening, y'all? This place is so cool. It's called Book and Bottle, located here on Central. And when you walk in this place, you, you don't really know what to expect, right? Because you see wine and champagne and... Hold on one second. It said press for champagne, so... We'll see. Uh, but not only that, check this out. You have a whole room here full of books and even more wine. It's such a cool place. They have different events here, book clubs, uh, uh, people that come in here and just, you know, get together and just the community is just all one. Dominic, this is so cool, man. Uh, these books here, tell us a little bit more about what type of books you guys have. Oh, yeah. We have things all genres from nonfiction to fiction, memoir, horror, mystery, romance. Wow. Yeah, anything that you can think of. Um, I'm very lucky I get to, I'm the head book purchaser. Oh. So I get to scour all the catalogs and be like, what does book and, what's book and bottles vibe? You know, mm -hmm. and the vibe is we want to carry things that the people who work here read, the people who come in here read. We want this bookstore to represent St. Pete. And so diversity, different authors. Um, we're also a women owned business. So I always make sure to really think and be like, how can I have as many female authors in here as possible yeah. to represent that demographic as well? So that's, that's very important to me. Yeah, that's awesome, man. Check this out, guys. They even have a whole bar over here where you can go get some cafe and coffee and other treats over there. Do you guys have any specialty drinks here? Um, our coffee is the specialty drink. Yes. We get, you know, I we, just had some not, too. it's so good. Um, we try and keep it very European, very stand, like very, uh, keep it simple. Yeah, you know, let the absolutely. coffee speak for itself. If you want a milkshake, go to steak and shake, you know, not here, you know, so the <laughs> coffee actually tastes good. It's bold. Um, and we have my favorite thing that I make is a cinnamon honey latte. Mm. So you got to ask for that. Yeah. Um, and it's just perfect. It's so, awesome, so good. Man. And yeah. Briefly, really quick before we get out of here, yeah. this is the new releases area, right? Yes, right here. Um, we every single Tuesday have new books here and we have always some really interesting stuff. The Great Transition is an amazing adventure book. Um, Shark Heart by Emily Habeck. Just finished this. It is about this um, newly married couple who fall in love and one of them turns into a shark. Weird story. Loved it. <laughs> awesome, man. Hey, you see, they got it all here. You know, I was looking at some others, history, politics, business, investing, you name it. Book and Bottle is the place to be right here on Central Avenue in St. Pete. Come have you some wine, get toe up. Well, don't get toe up. Just kind of get loose. That's the vibe. Just get loose. Man, and have some no caffeine, judgment. Uh, at the same time. You do you a yeah. book and bottle. Coffee, not Can't cafe, lost, but you know what yeah. I mean. Hey, yeah. sign me up for a uh, cinnamon <laughs> honey latte. It sounds really good. Delicious. You want one of those, Caitlin? I got you. Yeah, that sounds great. And some wine. <laughs> you got two hands. You said, you said, Dominic said earlier, you got two hands for a reason, right? <laughs> wine in one, coffee in the other.